Welcome back, guys. Uh, welcome to the garage. This is uh, this is where all the magic happens. This is where I had built the MR2, and I have a few other projects going on. But uh, for right now, there's not really too much going on with the MR2 uh, from the last video. I did get a new engine lid, and uh, I actually found it up in Bear Mountain, uh, New York, New Jersey area. It's a big MR2 meet for those MR2 guys that might watch this. But uh, yeah, I somehow found a guy with a paint match turbo engine lid, and uh, that's about it, really. There's not really much to it other than me waiting on parts and waiting on people to uh, you know build the parts. For those who don't know me or follow me on Instagram, um, I've been pretty focused on other things. Uh, I have other projects going on. So for starters, this is my 2004 Duramax. It's a LLY, and uh, as you can see, it's pretty hurt. So I've been kind of focused on this stuff, um, trying to rust prevent everything with this New Jersey weather. It's pretty well taken apart. Uh, I bought the truck with a dead cylinder, so I decided it only has 120,000 miles on it, so why not rebuild it and have a good daily driver? I currently drive a 2002 GMC Sierra. It's a 60 gasser, but if anyone's interested in seeing any of this, I can, you know, cover some footage on that and update you guys with this as well. I just haven't really put anything out about it just because I didn't really think anyone would find interest. If you couldn't tell already, I like things with turbos. So that's why I want to daily this. Um, I'm really excited for that. Like I said, guys, if you can just show me some interest in the comments, I will be sure to, you know, update you guys on videos on that. That should be going soon. But yeah, I have the MR2 turbos, love it. And uh, we have a surprise in here for you guys. This is my buddy's 2002 uh, S2000, and we are going to be putting a turbo on it. We have some things ordered, and if you guys stay tuned, we will be doing a video on that. So that's why you know, I've been taking so long to put out a video. I do apologize for you know, not doing that right away. Uh, I've been trying to gather equipment and everything to put out good content for you guys, so I'm working on that. I also have another surprise outside. If you didn't see it from the intro, uh, let's go bring you to it. This is my 1988 B2200, it's a Mazda. Um, obviously, as you can see, it has a turbo. And this was my buddy's truck, Anthony. Shout out to Anthony. Uh, he had this truck for about three years and you know he couldn't really finish the project, so you know life gets in the way and stuff. So I appreciate him for trusting me with his, uh, his build. So this is where I've kind of been focused on, more or less on, you know, in this winter. So we have a 2.0 liter uh, Mazda motor. It comes in the B2000. It's an 86 engine. It was freshly rebuilt. And this is just an eBay 50 trim turbo. And it runs down through here to the intercooler and the grill. It comes up, blow a valve to a blow through carb setup. It's not really a blow through carb, it's a Weber carb with a blow through style intake. Um, you know adapter so I got this truck not really running right um, I kind of had to do some work to it and I just kind of put these wheels on it just to see how it would look and I'm kind of in love with it but really this this truck kind of came to me out of nowhere and it really wasn't part of the plan and you know I just I just really haven't 
had any plans for it really. I just kind of wanted to get it running to show my buddy that, you know, I'd get it running for him, even though it's mine. I just wanted him to see that it was running. It runs and drives good. I put a full exhaust on the truck. I got these wheels on it. Uh, there's some gauges in the truck. There's some switches. There's no carpet in it right now. You know, it's kind of hard to see right now. But this is it. it. Does run and drive. Runs and drives pretty well. And that's kind of been my focus. All right, guys. And that pretty much sums up our video for the day. Um, first of all, I want to thank each and every one of you guys for the 15,000 views on my last video. I did not really expect that, but, um, you know, I'm seriously appreciative of you guys. So seriously, thank you for that. Also, um, you know, bear with us with our equipment. We're getting used to editing. We're trying to get used to our equipment. I did just crash my drone today <laughs> for the first time. There might be some, you know, kinks we got to work out in our videos, but other than that, um, you saw the mini truck and I kind of want to work with some subscribers with this. I want your ideas. So basically the motor's pretty like, I don't know, it's outdated, it's old, it smokes and you know, I'll have my fun with it. In the future, I want to, you know, see what you guys think on a swap. So, you know, any type of motor swap, I've been looking into diesel motors, you know, little 1.9 Volkswagen motors. Whichever you guys recommend, you know, I, I kind of want to steer towards that. So if you guys can give me any anything down in the comments below, I'll be reading them for sure. But other than that, guys, um, really, I just want to put out there that, you know, I'm going to try and put out a video about, you know, once every two weeks. That's our main goal. But, you know, we might we might be posting every week if we get the hang of it. So that's pretty much it for, for today. So I hope you like the video. Thanks.